Hey, so I just wanted to show off what I got in my Grand Blue Happy Bag at Oticon 2019 from the Sci Games booth. Uh, these bags are huge. They cost $70 and they sold out after a couple of hours and come with a bunch of stuff. So first thing we have is uh, this Percival hair scrunchy thing. Not really going to be useful for me because I'm a guy, but hey, it's something. Uh, we got a Siegfried. This is like a coin purse of some kind. There were a lot of bags in this bag, and this was the smallest one. Uh, next, here's a weird thing. We got a uh, piece. We got a necklace of some sort. Um, yeah, I, I don't recognize everything about and I think it's weird uh, there was a price on this one I think it was a uh, 2500 yen so it's like $25 so not a cheap little thing this was the most confusing thing we have a and that's my hand just so you can see how big it is this is maybe like a pencil like to put all your colored pencils in or there's no compartments in it of any kind but it is a hard plastic big case with a Siegfried on it so no idea what I'm going to do with this one and this one doesn't have a price but um, it's from 2017 originally. Uh, next up another one of the bags we got this uh, sleeping Jita and Gran with Vern. It's a nice little cream colored bag says Gran Blue on the back of it. We got a Dragon Knight branded Croquis. This is a pencil book or something. I don't, I'm, I'm not a person that draws, but uh, it is a cute little book. This was the weirdest thing. This is some sort of hand towel, which I wouldn't know it was Grand Blue at all, except you sort of have like weird, like in bright logo, and then it obviously says Grand Blue Fantasy on it. So it's something. Uh, we got two sets of two clear folders. The first one, we have uh, Beatrix and Zeta in waitress uniforms in red and blue. And then we got a set that is Randall and Feather. So those are pretty nice. Uh, this thing is cool. It is... You know, Hellas, Scatha, Cyril, and Neusch. These are like little post-it note type things. They're lists. Comes in a nice little folded thing with the sprite art. And it looks like a cute little book. Not using it. I think these are post-it notes as well. I can't really tell, but we have uh, Jamil and Eustace. And they're themed sort of around food, like uses a dinner plate. They're either that or erasers, I'm not sure. Um, next, we got, uh, Summer Luane, uh, acrylic stand, and the older ones, we got, and this is cool, I opened this just because I wanted to see what it was like, but, um, it is the, um, and I just botched it. It is the uh, anniversary art of uh, the Dragonites, Mordred, and Arthur. Um, nice little acrylic stand. Nice hard piece here. Um, so that's pretty cool. And speaking of that, and what I actually think is the coolest thing that I got in here, got a TCG play mat uh, that, you know, a lot of people use these as mouse pads of the same art. Uh, which is really cool because I actually bought the clear folder of this before I got the bag. So I ended up with three pieces of this art, but this one's clearly the nicest and the one I'll probably actually use because I uh, still play a little bit of card games. Uh, some more bags. Got a uh, Black Hole Vern. Um, all black tote bag. This one seems a little thin compared to some of the other ones, but um, yeah, it's Black Hole Vern. Got, um, this is Lancelot. This is a big one. Um, 
big tote bag. This one's probably like for actual books. So cream color with a yeah, it's a lot down there. Um, one of the funnier items, big old uh, Percival seat cushion. Nice, soft sit on, sit on Percival's face or something. That's your thing. Um, and then the last two things are gonna be the hardest to show. So we got a, um, got a uh, small, uh, smaller compared to the next one, uh, Summer Zeta towel, um, which it takes up about the same space as this coffee table, but it's a nice Summer Zeta. Um, and then this one, I guess you would call more of a blanket uh, or a beach towel. And it is, I'm not going to unfurl the whole thing, but it is a Chibi Dragon Knights. Got a Siegfried down there. Let's see a Lancelot down there. And this is like a full-size, like, beach towel type thing. It's really soft. You can use it as a blanket. And then, um, no, last thing. This was actually the cutest thing. These are post-it notes, um with her name is escaping me, the Dojin artist, um, uh, Lulalu. Uh, these are post-it notes where it's that famous sticker for holding up the things. So you can just write a little message on that and get that across. And then Grand Blue Pan Fantasy, the, uh, the pen. This is, um, uh, this is Jin, a purple pen of some sort. And then the final thing was, uh, if you were spending $100 at the booth, you got a um, fourth anniversary, uh, one of those waterproof um, cell phone bags with a lanyard. And if you spent uh, any amount of money, you got uh, one of 10 random keychains. Uh, I ended up getting Lancelot. So yeah, that is the, uh, the surprise bag, and it was very good.